Today I am going to talk about FACO sites. As you know, the general activities of FACO site cells are to, to survey the tissue compartments and discover microbes, particles such as dust, carbon particles, antigen antibody complexes, and injured or dead cells. To ingest and eliminate these materials, finally to extract immunogenic information antigens from foreign matter. As you know, we have three kinds of phagocyte cells, including neutrophil, monocyte, and macrophages. In neutrophils versus isonophil, as you know, a common sign of bacterial infection is a high neutrophil level in blood, which is called neutrophilia. Neutrophils are a primary component of pus. In contrast, eosinophil plays a minor phagocyte role in compared to the neutrophil, but it is attracted to the site of parasite infections and antigen antibody reactions. Okay. Macrophages, if, if you remember, as I said before, migrated monocytes are transformed by a various inflammatory mediator to macrophages. Monocyte in the bloodstream, macrophages in the tissue. The developmental stages of monocyte and macrophages as you know, this process is marked by an increase in size and by enhanced developmental of lysosome and other organelles. If I need to describe it, in a stem cell in the bone marrow developed to a pro monocyte and these cells go to the bloodstream which is called according to the, this developmental stages called it monocyte when these cell migrated or transformed by various inflammatory mediator to tissue which is called it macrophages macrophages are king of phagocytes cells as you know, macrophages, we can classify them into fixed adhere to tissue or wandering moved around. هذا التقسيم يعتمد على بقاهم بسبيسيفيك أورجان أو ممكن يتنقلون يعتمدون على الستيج أو يعتمدون على الميون ستيميول اللي يستقبلوه ولذلك يضطرون أنه يتحركون المكان The specialized macrophage we call it a histiocyte This cell migrate to the certain tissue and remain there during their lifespan The name of macrophages are changeable according to the site or according to the tissue as an example in lung we call it alveolar macrophages cover cell in the liver linger hands in the skin macrophages in other tissues like spleen lymph node bone marrow kidney and brain other macrophages do not reside permanently in a particular tissue not only are the macrophages tishtogol keskafinger, but they also process foreign substance and to prepare them for reaction with B or T lymphocytes. 
that's an example of liver tissue and copper cells of the macrophages. What's the mechanism of phagocytic discovery, engulfment, and killing? We call it phagocytosis. As you know, phagocytosis means engulfment of particles by cells, and then these particles by endocytosis, the phagocytes actually endocyte both particles and liquid substance, and this or this process has events including chemotaxis, ingestion, phagolysosome formation, destruction, and excretion. I think you know all of these steps before I've described them. We have a question. Why phagocyte, phagocytosis considered not just the physical process of engulfment, because phagocytes are also active, uh, actively attacked and eliminate foreign cells with a wide array of antimicrobial substances. I'll describe these antimicrobial substances later. The first event or the first step of phagocytosis, chemotaxis or ingestion. In the macro signal mean the site of infection ma ma can see phagocytosis the phagocyte cells migrate to into the a region of inflammation attracted by uh, a kid aku receptor stimulant to protect from the parasite or host tissue at the site of injury phagocytosis عرفناها ممكن يصير لها enhancement عن طريق ال opsonization ال opsonization هو اللي شنو اللي راح يتدخل هي ال process that coat the surface of micro or microorganisms with antibodies or complement thereby facilitating recognition and engulfment وبالتالي عبرنا عنها عم اللي ال ال enhancement اللي يسويه للفيجوسيتوسيس من قبل opsonization when the phagocyte has made contact with its prey, it extended pseudo border or pseudo borders that includes the cell or particles in a pocket and internalize them in a vacuole which is called phagosome. And then the phagosome هو شنو بعد ما صارت عملية الفيجوسيتوسيس جتني الأقدام الكاذبة دخلت البارتيكلز أو الليكويد بداخلها صارت عملية الفيجوسوم بعدها سوري بعدها راح تبدي عملية الفيجو لايسوزوم فورميشن أند كيلينج اللايسوزيمز اللي هو راح يهاجر لل للفيجوسوم ويصير فيوجن وياهم يسوي لي تركيبة اللي يسمونها فيجو لايسوزوم اللي هي عبارة عن الفيجوسوم بلس لايزوزايم Other granules containing antimicrobial chemicals اللي هي ممكن تتحرر للفيجو لايسوزوم تكون لي a potent pro designed to poison and then analyze the ingested materials. يعني هاي الماتيريالز ال antimicrobial chemical إضافة لللايزوزايم بداخل الفيجولايزوزايم راح تعتبر مواد قوية حتى تحلل لي الميكروبز أو البارتيكلز. Okay. هذه العملية ممكن تستمر لمدة 30 ملي سكافينجرز. هنا إذا تذكرون قلت أكو chemical materials إلها دور قوي بالكيلينج اللي هي مسؤولة عن destruction and elimination we have several substances يعملون مع بعض يعتبرونهم a great killing power like myelopyroxidase هو enzyme found in the granulocyte يعتبر halogen ion forms halogen ions that, that represent a strong oxidizing agents. 
hydrogen peroxidase H2O2 super oxide anion activated oxygen the hydroxyl uh, free radical liberated of lactic acid lysozyme nitric oxide if you are powerful mediator cationic protein a number of phagolytic hydrolytic enzyme all of these material represent a great killing power substances help to kill the microbes is adun with destruction will elimination if i need to describe the phagocytes by another way chemotaxis and contact and the ingestion formation of phagolysozyme granules with with phagosome killing amaliat lysine uh, releasing lil debris as a final state okay we have Another materials like interferon, antiviral cytokines, and immune stimulant. Interferon, a small protein produced naturally by a certain white blood cells and tissue cells that is used in therapy against certain viral infection, infections and cancer. Okay, I think all of you know about in, uh, interferon the role of interferon as a therapy against viral infections or cancer we have three kinds of uh, interferon interferon alpha beta and gamma the alpha one a product of lymphocyte and macrophages beta interferon a product of fibroblast and epithelial cell while the gamma one a product of t cell all are produced in response to the viruses, RNA, immune product, uh, various antigens. In addition of antiviral activity, all three interferon can inhibit the expression of cancer genes and have a tumor suppressor effect. We have another role of interferon. Interferon act as important immune regulator cytokines that activate the development of white blood cell. Alpha interferon produced by T cell activates a subset of cell which is called the natural killer cells. Beta interferon plays a role in maturation of beta and uh, B and T lymphocyte and in inflammation. Gamma interferon inhibits cancer cells, stimulating B lymphocyte, activates macrophages, and enhances the effectiveness of phagocytosis. Okay, following the phagocytosis, this is the topic I will talk about more than what I have on the screen. Following the phagocytosis. مثل ما نعرف الباثوجين are subjected to the variety of killing mechanisms يعني مثلا بعد ما يصير عملية اللايسوزوم فيوجن ويا الفيغوسوم راح يصير عندنا change بال pH rise in the pH of the فيغولايسوزوم وبعدها راح شنو ينزل ال pH خلال 15 إلى من خلال 10 إلى 15 دقيقة وبالتالي هاي العملية ممكن تأثر بعملية الكلين أوكي أكو أشياء ثانية ممكن نعم أكو أشياء ثانية production of uh, reactive oxygen intermediated in activated macrophages which is which is which occurs immediately after internalization هذا أيضا ممكن ممكن يأثر أيضا الدفنسينز ممكن يأثر زين راح هنا نشوف هذه بحالة وجود أكسجين dependent وبحالة أكسجين independent. نريد نشوف شنو الفرق الميجر differences between 
like resting and activated macrophages is the ability to generate H2O2 and other metabol metabolized gen uh, generated by respiratory burst. In the presence of myeloperoxidase, higher levels of reactive oxygen metabolized will be generated. Macrophage can be activated by interferon gamma to express high levels of inducible nitric oxide INOS synthetase, which catalyzes the protection of nitric oxide from arginine, release of NO by macrophage, contribute to killing intracellular pathogen either directly or by protection